So we're gonna work, uh, start working here in the Lahiva. So I'm gonna have my cross collar, my De La Hiva hook. I'm gonna control the sleeve on the same side I have the collar. And my other foot's gonna be on his knee. So first thing here, I need to open his base a little bit because he's like too close, it's hard for me to move him around. So I'm gonna push here his leg to make him do a step back. And now I'm gonna look here to drive this arm in front of my shin as I turn my body and start dragging him towards the side here. So he's gonna fall. So when I get here, I'm gonna change my head position. Like I'm, like I'm going for a burning bolo. So I move my head all the way to the other side. After this, I'm gonna let go my hooks. Now I'm gonna push my hip over to go mount. So I invert like I'm going for a burning bolo and then I push my hips over to the mount position. So here again, got my collar grip, my sleeve, push his leg, make him step back, drive that arm in front of my shin. Now I'm gonna start pushing and dragging him back. And when he fall, roll my head to the other side you know, I push my hips over and come to mount. So you start inverting, shoot your hips over and finishing mount. So that will be the first option we're going to be working today. Um, second option we're going to do here, we're going to come up in a different way. So let's see, I have trouble to invert and finishing the positioning mount. So I'm going to attack the same thing. So I'm going to push his leg drive the arm in and then start making me fall on his butt. But from here, I'm gonna let go my hooks and bring my leg back. Now I'm gonna shoot to come up inside his guard. From here. Most of the times my partner will have this knee in. Otherwise I'm gonna come up on a half guard. So you're gonna bend this knee. So you're gonna have this. So and then he's gonna have this and I'm gonna come up trying to already push his hips towards the other side. You won't, you won't be like that. So here I push his leg, drive the arm in. And I'm gonna make him fall on his butt. From here, I'm gonna let go of my legs. I'm gonna shoot my both legs to help me come up here, boom. And now his legs on the way, right? You can switch for the other collar, start getting up on your toes and push his legs to the opposite side. So from here I can start way better for me to start my passing, then being right here when he can adjust his grips and start working to sweep me back. So looking to, and when you finish the sweep here, you already start getting up on your feet and push the legs to the op opposite side, keeping your chest down. So now I can start looking for, for my pass. Now let's see, I'm starting, this is uh, one of the reactions happen often if you, if you like, let's see, I'm trying to do with Eric, so he's bigger than me. So that situation can happen because it's gonna be, can be harder for me to control his arm inside if I don't get a sweep right away. So in this situation can happen then when I attack the sweep, he managed to post and then start open up his knee. I'll go back. So before, go there again. Before he stapled my leg all the way and now I, I have hard time to get my foot out and then he starts smashing my, my top leg. If I feel like that's gonna start to happen, so he pulls the hand, I feel like he wants to open that knee, right? So I'm gonna take my leg out before he stapled the leg. Now I'm gonna start pulling the collar and moving my hip to the other side, and I'm gonna shoot the omoplata here. I'm gonna sit up, and I can uh, attack to finish the omoplata, move my legs back, he started going towards his head. But that has to be like, it's gonna be, it has to be like a quick reaction for him to prevent the sweep and also has to be a quick reaction for me to attack the omoplata. So I'm gonna push the leg, so I'm gonna go. As soon as I feel like he posted, he wants to open that knee, I let go of my De La Riva, keep this foot on the hip to help move my hip to the other side. As I drag here, I move my hip like I'm doing a collar drag, I keep controlling the sleeve and I shoot the omoplata. Now I sit up, control around his back, 
my legs go back and I start going towards his head to finish.